So the dust has cleared and we're five episodes in, so I think we can evaluate this show now. Boku no Hero Academia, has it lived up to the hype? Now I'm going to try and remove my thoughts from the manga and solely focus on the anime and the body of work that we've received. So honestly, it's been exactly what I expected it to be, a typical shonen. Now while I won't go as far as calling it a Naruto reskin, you see the similarities and while that isn't a bad thing, that can be what's kind of, I don't know, possibly hindering the show. What I mean is it's so similar with a lot of things, instead of having new feelings towards these characters, you can't help but compare, right? So for instance, Aizawa. I saw numerous Kakashi comparisons and it's justified, especially with the use of, you know, red eyes. I mean, come on. I mean, for sure it's not One Punch Man, right? One Punch Man gave you a feeling that was different and easy to follow, while Boku no Hero is simple, but it's more complex than One Punch Man. It has a lot more characters to remember with quirks and all these different things. So final thoughts. Boku no Hero is solid, a good adaptation, but not necessarily game changing. Let me know what you thought about Boku no Hero, and if you have any other shows you'd like me to do an overview on, let me know in the comment section. So as always, like the video if you did, subscribe to the channel if you have not, that would be dope. Have a good day, people.